Hello Earth Signs, Taurus, Cappy, Virgo, welcome back to my channel everyone. Thank you so much my lovelies for being here with me for your weekend tarot reading. This is going to be focused for all the Earth Signs, so Taurus, Cappy, Virgo, or to the Cross Watchers who are dealing with an Earth Sign as well. Um, it is going to be love reading focused on what's coming up in the next 24 to 48 hours. What can the Tarot come up with and predict here for you? Um, just a quick reminder, if you would like a private reading with me, please feel free to email me and we can certainly go ahead and arrange that for you. Otherwise, I do hope this reading is helpful. Don't forget to drop a like if you enjoy it and also to subscribe to the channel. Uh, to get updates for when, for when readings for your sign and your element are posted to the channel. Otherwise, let's go ahead and jump into this for Earth Signs. Let's see what's coming up for you. Next 24 to 48 hours. Okay, overall energy, what's crowning your reading is the Empress. So this is really beautiful. I feel like you're stepping into a very harmonious next phase here. And I think um, this period is going to be very crucial for you into attracting that sort of light, that golden sort of energy here. She's got the crown of stars. So there's some highly spiritual activity um, that's about to happen here. And I get a strong vibe, Earth signs, that you are connecting with someone on an energetic level. Now, this is some powerful, vibrational, telepathic, te uh, telekinetic type kind of kind of energy here. Um, so I feel like what's what's coming up here is that this this energy um, is is starting to build up more and more. Um, and I love that the Two of Cups has come up here because it's either you're connecting and meeting with this person for the first time or there is an existing soulmate twin flame connection in your life here. And it's like you only, the two of you only seeing each other. So it could be like you know them for a while now, but for the first time or maybe for the first time in a long time, you're reconnecting and it's only you and them. You're going to share a super, super special moment um, during this time. And I feel like that's what that Empress is bringing you. There's potentially a pregnancy or a conception that may be happening around here. Um, and the Queen of Swords energy is telling me that you attracted this. It's almost like you saw it, you spoke about it, you predicted it. It's almost like a deja vu moment that you may have. And it's either you've spoken it into existence or you've sort of um, told a friend about it or you were speaking to someone special about this and then next thing you know it just will happen in the physical and you might be in a little bit of shock um, as to how that happens but I think it's going to be quite rewarding and you'll be very you'll be very happy um, where you're at here earth signs you have come up as the four of pentacles so I feel like um, you want to hold on to this kind of energy you know you want to savor it you want to be in it so be present don't think about what you're doing the next day, next week, next year. Be present in the moment because we never really know when moments are turned into memories. But I see you, for the most part, wanting to hold on to this connection and hold on to the value of that moment and that memory. And I feel like you will be. I do feel like you may be clingy. Okay, some of you are becoming a bit clingy. Um, regarding this connection, regarding what's going on here, but it's not in an unhealthy, obsessed way, okay? It's in a way where you're starting to see the value. Now, this is also for you, Earth Signs. It could be that the person you're connecting with is starting to see your value <clears throat> and really wanting to connect here with you, but I do get some sort of proposal. I feel like there's a conversation, um, like a text, um, a message, a combo that's going um, to take place, and someone's going to propose something pretty bizarre here to you. It's, it, I mean, it's coming up as the Ace of Wands, so it could be like uh, moving in together, it could be, you know, spending more time together, it's anything about taking action and, and, and um, engaging in some sort of activity that's going to move you forward, so it could even be like being intimate for the first time. It's like a bold and daring proposal, but I feel like it's given to you, so I feel like you're going to be on the receiving side of it, but, and I don't know if you, on some energetic crazy psychic level you sort of saw this coming okay I feel like there was some sort of anticipation or an expectancy on your side and you're like okay it's coming I feel it they're gonna do it like they're gonna propose or they're gonna say it they're gonna ask me out like they've they've been building up to this and I feel like you know that time is um <clears throat> that time is it is coming up here for you so there's an element of, of excitement with it there is 
But I also feel like with this proposal, the first thing you'll think about or the first thing that's sort of going to come to mind for you, Earth signs, is like, how are you going to deal with it? You know, I'm, I'm getting this energy where you'll be in a state where you're like, okay, well, how do I cope with this? Or what do I need to do? What, what are the steps I need to take or the sacrifices I need to take? You're going to be looking things at like what's best for you. And you might be in a partnership, but for some reason, I feel like somehow the first question or the things you're really going to be thinking about is, okay, what's in it for me? Or what, are, you know, how does this benefit me? I feel like you're going to be thinking more about you. That's not necessarily a bad thing because it is a big step, you know, um, and it obviously is something you need to think about. I don't want to take the magic away from it and predict what this is, but I do feel like it's something that's going to move you forward and I do feel like it has the potential to change the dynamic of this connection um, and very much of this relationship. So, you know, you'll be sort of assessing it from your side going, okay, how's this going to benefit me? What's it going to do for me? But, you know, you'll have these thoughts in your mind and this is good, but I don't feel like you're going to share it with that other person. Queen of Swords, she's got the beak of the bird shut. So what's going on here? You're not revealing these thoughts. You might even be quiet and like your person will be like, you know, what's up? What are you thinking about? Really internally, you know, you've got this internal um, conversation going on in your mind and, you know, but you're, you're not telling that person, you're not, you're not sharing that with them. You're not telling them how you feel about that. So that's quite interesting. It's quite interesting, but I feel like there may be after this offer, I feel like there's some silence. So I don't know if some of you sort of need to think about it or you're going to want to take time out because I feel like this is like, this is a lot to take in. Like, this is a lot of news, a lot of information. This this offer is coming with a lot. And understandably, I see some of you sort of backing away from this. I don't even know if it's going to make you feel more overwhelmed or like push this person away unintentionally. But be careful if that's not what you're wanting, because that could be like a byproduct of what's going on here. But overall, the Empress is bringing you like you're being uplifted. So you're on a pedestal here. OK, someone's starting to see your worth, your value. They're starting to really care for you. They're putting you on a pedestal here. There's there's elevation here. And for the most part, I see a lot of, a lot of you on cloud nine. So obviously, there's an injection of happiness coming here, Earth signs. But overall, it does seem pretty damn good. So um, I'll leave it there. But I do hope that has been helpful. Thank you again, everyone, for tuning in. Um, Taurus Cappy Virgo. Uh, don't forget to drop a like on this vid and also to subscribe to the channel. I would be very much um, appreciative for that. Take care everyone and until next time, bye for now.